Hello everyone. In this session, we're going to be adding drivers to the WDS server and we're going to need to add them to the boot image. We begin by clicking on Tools, Windows Deployment Services. We want to expand the server view and we want to expand our server. And we want to select drivers. We want to right click on the driver tab and click add driver package. We have a choice here of selecting the INF file if we have it available or selecting the package. We might have more than one INF file in a package. Uh, we will need to find that package and find the particular INF file that we want. So we want to click on select the driver package from a folder and we're going to browse and we're going to look for that folder. We're going to click the computer view and we're going to do the E drive, the E volume. And we're going to click this down arrow. We're going to double click until we find that folder. And I want you to look at me carefully because you're going to have to do this for your lab exercise. So we're going to double click until we find that folder. So we double clicking as we go down to scroll down the page. And there we have our folder wireless LAN. We're going to click on the folder and click on OK. So we have the driver package in the location that we had saved it. And we want to click on Next to continue. And we have a number of INF files. And we want to deselect the ones that we don't want. We want this last one, the third one here. So we're going to deselect the one above that and then select the first one so that we have the one that we need selected. We're going to click on next to continue. We want to click on next a second time. And we can see that the driver package is being added. Want to click on next to continue. And now we have to find a group because in order to deploy the packages to the clients, you have to add them to a driver group. So we're going to add them to a group that we already have. So we click on select an existing driver group. We see that we have a group called driver group one. So we want to click on next to continue. And then we want to click on finish because we have successfully added the driver package to the server. So we want to click on finish. What we have to do now is to add that driver, the INF driver to the boot image. So we want to double click the boot image here. Let's try that again. Let's click on the boot image. And the first image here is the boot image that we want to use. So we're going to click on the first one to select it. And we actually want to right click on that image and say add driver packages to image. And the wizard will add the driver package to the boot image. And remember that you should always back up your image before you try to add the driver. And to do that, you will simply right click the image in the snap in and click export image. All right, let us continue by clicking next. And we can either click on add to add the driver package or we could click on search for the package. We're going to try search for the package and we can see here that we have the NFL that we want. 
So we want to click on next to continue. And the package that we have will be added to that boot file where we click on next. So you can see here that we have successfully added the driver to the boot image. Uh, we click on finish. We have successfully added the driver to the boot image in the WDS console. I want to thank you for listening.